I forget what you do for this uh, interlude with Peach. I think the next chapter, or after chapter 5, you need to make the potion. I forget. Oh, I think, isn't this one the quiz? It might be. I hope there's more characters like that boo in Creepy Steeple that gives you questions. Or gives you a quiz too. If he wanted to be rich, all he had to do is just buy a bunch of dry shrooms, sell them, and just do that for a couple of days and he'll be rich. This music is new. I wonder if we're gonna hear something like this in the Palace of Shadow later on. Or if this is text theme. That was, thankfully, not too bad. And unfortunately, I'm, I'm just not a super huge fan of the Princess Peach sections. I kind of wish she did a little bit more. <laughs> Sweet young thing. Can't she just fly there herself? Or she could have actually just flew over the cheap cheap. And the Bowser could have just trampled over him. Or he could just use that to fly over to I think he plans on flying over to Glitzville. But I mean he could have just used it to fly over, get to the cheap cheap blimp. I guess the driver in the cheap cheap blimp would ask for the tickets too, maybe? I know it doesn't go good for Bowser here, flying all the way over. Stay out of gas. That's funny that they reused that. I think that you reused it one more time in chapter five. Ooh, this looks nice. Some pretty strong fire to exist underwater. Okay, there you go. Almost got hurt by a blooper. A 
It's interesting that that uh, coral is still there. Oh, an X knot. <laughs> I was wondering what hit me. Or for the best, if I can get another ham. There we go. There's a spring around here. There you go. That's what you want to go on. You don't want to go into the pipe. This is a nice take on this theme. <laughs> Why is there Rockhawk merch? It should be me, I'm the champion over there. I guess because I'm not over there right now. I guess he's the, bi the head honcho over there while I'm gone. This is also another interesting take on this song. Uh, it's, it's interesting. I don't know if I like it, though. Yeah, maybe a little bit. Also, I'm red again because I took off my, uh... W emblem. Oh, now it goes away. Well, let's uh, head back then. Go get that. Uh, we can get spec shield now, so that's good. We can go to the thousand year door and then get some of that music and art unlocked. But Vivian knows this already, doesn't she? Or is Beldum the only one aware of it? I want to say that the other two are aware. Hmm. Maybe she didn't say more because she's aware of the fact of what's actually there. Oh, we can also rank up uh, Vivian too. I think we'll do that one... Uh, after we get the Crystal Star and it warps us up to Frankly, I'll rank her up there. We can get Mao's as well, so that's nice. So we got the cookbook, so cooking is going to be a lot better. But I think before I do any cooking, uh, what I'll need to do is go... Oh, <laughs> oh you know what? Uh, there is a badge I want to get after all this. It'll be important for... Uh, not having to deal with these fights. I think it's first strike. Remember, uh, Frankly was recommending that. Yeah, he did, right? Let's see. Did I not get an- oh, there it is, a must-have badge. Yeah, 
Yeah, we'll get we'll get that after we go put the new crystal star in. Do I need to heal? Nah, I'm good. Definitely is nice to see all the party members come out for this. Three more. Hopefully they make some of the Keyhole Key stuff a lot easier, because... Man, the island stuff is really... Uh, it's just backtracky. Thankfully, Piranha Plants aren't annoying to uh, have to bob and weave through in this game, or this version of the game. My god, you would always run into them, and they're annoying. But considering how they made uh, Chapter 4 less backtracky, Hoping they're gonna do something similar too, because there's no fast way to get into the, the cave in Kyoho Key. So I'm assuming they're gonna add some sort of fast travel to there. Is this the first time you do a first a fourth wall break? Ooh, I like this music. <laughs> On the lay motif, that's nice. Oh, Jolene. Okay, so he is planning. Maybe we'll get an email saying that he's ready to fight. Oh, wait, what was that? Spicy. Uh, <laughs> bubble where I gave a hot dog to. At least we get fiery jinx now. <laughs> That's gonna be really good. It's like one of the better moves of the game. Just being able to deal damage and then the burn. And this action command itself isn't too hard to do. Unless you have three on Super Fire Zarn, it might be a little hard to get the full power of it, but it's not bad. Okay, I want to go to. Um, I want to go to the bad shop to get that first strike. But I think we want to get the Zesty Trouble that's here for the cookbook. Oh, 
Oh, you know what's something we can do right now? We can, uh, unlock, uh, Bobbery's door. Gives us another Shine Sprite too, but we can't really do anything with Shine Sprites right now. Oh, he reacts to that. <laughs> That's good. Here for your Shine Sprite, old man. I think we need to talk to him for him to unlock the door. And there, now I don't have to do it later on. Uh, has Battletoad got anything to say? Ooh, soft stomp. It just decreases defense by three, I think. Doesn't really get too much use in this game. Oh, that's nice to know. You can hear his song more. It's more piratey now. Uh, is this first attack? Yep. Zero BP? Didn't he used to cost BP before? I think he used to be like one. That's really nice. Um. Uh, yeah, I'll put on W of them. I like it. Um, I think another damage judge would be nice. Do I want to walk around and save me some cash? Hmm. Head rattle's pretty cool. I think we get one later in this chapter. Sleepy stuff. Why did they make this move so good, dude? It's unreasonable. It should cost more BP and more FP. Is that? Or just do what the original game did and you can wake somebody up when they're asleep by hitting them. Or is there's a chance to at least. Uh, I will get the damage dodge. I got the cash. I think she cooks you a honey shroom when uh, she makes something. the same as a hot dog. Um, so let's see. I think I need a fire shroom. Let me check my items. Yeah, so I want to cook the golden leaf. And I saw a point swap. Okay. I don't think they're going to change this because a uh, point swap I think I've said it before, but uh, when you cook a point swap, it gives you the inverse item associated with it. So the inverse item associated with the fire flower is ice storm. And we're gonna need that to cook with the golden leaf.
That's good that it shows what your ingredient one and ingredient two is. That way, she just doesn't have to ask. Now we can cook Ice Storm with Golden Leaf. Also, I could probably make a Jam and Ultra right now to just ease up those items. Or it's not a Jam and Ultra. It's a, uh, I think, Ultra Jelly. Also, there are a couple of items, I think, that have... I hope they fixed it, where they didn't localize it properly. Let me see what that is. I think it's like one of the Zest Pops or something like that. Something you cook with a nice storm. I think it says frappe, which is an ice storm and either maple syrup or jam and jelly. Because I believe in the original game it says it heals HP, but it's actually 20 FP. And the similar effect of, um... Similar effect of freezing you if you use it in battle. I'll just click the, uh... Golden Leaf. That'll give me a Zesty. Oh, I didn't skip it. My bad. <laughs> oh, also when you cook stuff with uh, point swaps, it looks like it failed. But uh, there are some recipes that look like they fail and they still work. Probably gonna store the Jelly Ultra. I don't need it for right now. What's this guy got? Uh, I might get Timing Tutor. Cause some of the stylishes feel a little bit different than what I'm used to. So I just wanna see if that's actually true or if I'm just getting it slightly off because of the 30 frames a second. Although the 30 frames a second so far hasn't affected gameplay all too much. Oh, also one of the things the cookbook does is you can actually use um, the horse tails and petal meadows to get spicy soup. Because before you needed to use the fire flower, but now you can use those to get that. Okay, I think we're gonna get Mouse now, so we'll do her quest. <laughs> this may be dangerous. Oh, it's dangerous, all right. Be dangerously boring having to walk all the way to Hooktail's castle and back. Um, I'm actually gonna have to take a quick break, so there might be a weird cut here. See you guys in a bit. 